The family of a woman whose partially mummified body was found in their home believed she was alive. For months after she died, an inquest heard. The family of a woman whose partially mummified body was found in their home believed she was alive. For months after she died, an inquest heard. Rina Yasutake, 49, shared a home with her mother and two siblings in Helmsley, North Yorkshire Village. She had been dead for weeks when paramedics found her in bed on September 25, 2018. Rina Yasutake, 49, shared a home with her mother and two siblings in Helmsley, North Yorkshire Village. She had been dead for weeks when paramedics found her in bed on September 25, 2018. Craig Hassel KC representing the family asked death in spee Nicola Holden if the family was utterly convinced that she was alive when the emergency services attended her siblings and their mother. Michiko Yasutake, 80, were originally charged with preventing a lawful and decent burial. But the prosecution was halted when it was found the family members suffered from a rare mental disorder. Craig Hassel KC representing the family asked death in spee Nicola Holden if the family was utterly convinced that she was alive when the emergency services attended. Craig Hassel KC representing the family asked death in spee Nicola Holden if the family was utterly convinced that she was alive when the emergency services attended. Rina Yasutake, 49, shared a home with her mother and two siblings in Helmsley, North Yorkshire Village. Craig Hassel KC representing the family asked death in spee Nicola Holden if the family was utterly convinced that she was alive when the emergency services attended. Her death was discovered by paramedics on 25 September 2018. The Home Office's pathologist Dr. Jennifer Bolton said it was difficult to determine how long Ms. Yasutake had been dead given the extent of mummification. Craig Hassel KC representing the family asked death in spee Nicola Holden if the family was utterly convinced that she was alive when the emergency services attended. Rina Yasutake, 49, shared a home with her mother and two siblings in Helmsley, North Yorkshire Village. Home Office pathologist Dr. Jennifer Bolton said it was difficult to determine how long Ms. Yasutake had been dead given the extent of mummification but that the level to which it had developed took several weeks. Craig Hassel KC representing the family asked death in spee Nicola Holden if the family was utterly convinced that she was alive when the emergency services attended.